Hey guys, before this video begins, I want to let you all know that we have a Minecraft Daycare official t-shirt for sale right now that is just in time for your return to school. You can find it in the description down below, but be quick. We're only selling this for a limited amount of time. So without further ado, let's get back into the video. <laughs> uh, morning, Mom. Breakfast smells good. Um, who are you calling Mom, Buster? Uh, huh? It's, it's Tori? Uh, 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 sorry about that. I guess the flight here must have messed with me a bit. <laughs> I'm pulling your leg. Hey, breakfast is almost done. Would you mind waking everyone up? Sure. If you don't mind me asking, what did you make? Breakfast, silly. Well, yeah, but, but, but I'm asking for the specifics. Go get everybody and you'll find out. Go on, shoo. All right, all right, I'm going. Matt, if you come in here and give me surprise tickles again, I'm going to give you two surprise black eyes. Got it? Uh, I'm not mad. Please don't hurt me. Oh, hey Ryan. I'm assuming you have a good reason for interrupting my beauty sleep? Yeah, uh, Tori's making us breakfast. She wants you to come out and, well, uh, eat it, I suppose. Oh good, that Tori. Always thinking two steps ahead. Honestly, you're so lucky that she took an interest in a goof like you. What? Wh what's that supposed to mean? Relax, it's a compliment. Anyway, see you at the table. Huh, I am not a goof. Yo, Matt! Wake up! Hibernation season is over! No more treasure for me, Captain Gerald. I already have enough cereal. <sighs> Matt! Food! Food? Uh, where? Point me in the direction, buddy! The kitchen. Right. That sounds obvious now that I said it out loud. Uh, anywho, I'm gonna go grab some grub. The only thing Matt loves more than sleep is food. Let's hope our rations last the whole trip. All right, time to poke the sleeping lion. Hey Aaron, time for breakfast. Huh? Oh, good. I was starting to get hungry. Come on, Freckles. <coughs> Thanks, I guess. Huh, well that went unexpectedly smoothly. Well, all right. Time for some breakfast, I suppose. Hmm, Ryan, sit down and join us already before your food gets cold. Or before Matt swoops in and swallows a hole. I'm already on seconds. I better start eating then. All right, gang, what are we doing today? Oh, I'm totes getting a suntan. <gasps> it's time to break out my new super cute swimsuit. I'll be right back. Well, if I had to guess, we're probably going to be spending the day having fun at the beach. I better oil up, because I burn easy. What? No, no, no. If you burn easy, I don't want you to oil up. I... wait. Uh, really? Wait, wait, no. No, no, no. I'm thinking of sunblock. That's what I meant. Right. You don't want to look like a fried flounder. Hmm. Fried flounder. Oh, right, right. Uh, I'm going to go do that and get changed. What about you, Aaron? Are you... I'm staying inside. Uh, oh, really? That's too bad, then. The last thing I want to be doing is having a beach of palooza with you losers. So yeah, too bad, I guess. Whoa, step off, Aaron. Just because you're in a bad mood all the time doesn't mean you have to be mean to her. No, it's all right, Ryan. That's just how Aaron is. But- I said it's all right. Uh, Aaron, I brought a few books if you'd like to borrow one to read. I wouldn't want you to go bored staying inside all day. <laughs> Thanks, but I brought my own. So stop worrying about me and go have your little party. What a jerk. True, but you shouldn't antagonize him. Doing that will only make it worse. Besides, we're all here to relax and have fun. Let's try to keep it that way. I guess you're right. Of course I am. I'm a girl after all. Anyway, I better get changed. I suggest you do the same. Unless you want to go swimming in those jeans and a long sleeve shirt. Uh, no. Of course not. I brought my big boy trunks. Your big boy trunks? Please, just call it a swimsuit. You can't take away my funny words. 
welcome to vacation. So, how do you like my new swimsuit? Oh my gosh, it's perfect on you! <laughs> I know, but yours is so gorgeous that I'm kind of jealous I didn't pick that one. Nonsense, yours is way more perfect for the VIP's beach party. You think so? Oh, thanks, Tori. You're the bestest friend ever. <laughs> right back at you, girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> are they fangirling over swimsuits? Ryan, girls are an unfathomable enigma that are profoundly impossible to comprehend. Uh, did you even understand the sentence you just said? Not gonna lie, I'm pretty sure one of the words that just came out of my mouth are made up. Right, well, next time I need true understanding of girls or help with my English homework, I know who not to ask. So, Matt, how do I look? You look fine. Just, just fine? So, like, not good enough? No, I didn't- You hate it, don't you? You think it looks ugly on me. No, no, I didn't say that. But you thought it to think my own Matt would turn against me. What a cruel world. <laughs> no, I... Uh, I guess I'll have to catch up with you later, Ryan. Yeah, way later. You're kind of in a bit of a pickle. Don't worry, she's on actually upset. Really? How can you tell? It's just one of those things guys wouldn't know. Besides, Lexi has too big of an ego to get offended by Matt's opinion. I don't think Matt's opinion would affect anybody, if I'm being honest. <laughs> you guys are tough on poor Matt. Hey, if he's going to mooch breakfast off of me almost every morning, he can take a few punches. <laughs> I understand. Anyways, let's get to the fun part, shall we? The, the fun part? Y you mean... Swimming, Ryan. Let's go swimming. R right, right. Uh, that's what I thought, too. Uh, let's go do that. What? I'm busy. Meow. Reading a book. What else? Meow. I don't care. I'm not going out there. Meow. Then go by yourself. You don't need me to tag along. Meow. You wanted to go outside with me, so here. I'm outside. Now stop pestering me about it. No. This is as far as you're getting me. Now stop your whining and deal with it. No. <laughs> Ugh, so lame. Come on, let's go. No swimming, though. Well, hey, look who decided to join us. Had a change of heart? Get lost, loser. I'm trying to enjoy the beach in peace. Well, all right then. We're already taking a dip. Want to join? No! Uh, no, not really. I don't want to go swimming. Uh, oh, all right then. Glad you're letting loose, at least. Whatever. Now can I read my book in peace? Sure, man. Hey, Tori, let's go bury Matt in the sand. What? No! Stay away from me! <laughs> yeah, whatever. <sighs> so what should I do with you, uh, Blob? 
Is it okay if I call you Blob? Right. Well, is there any way you can stop staring at me? Okay. Well, we got that cleared up. I'm just gonna go back to work now. Alright, that's it. I'm taking my vacation early. This paperwork can wait. But, what about you? Hmm. You know, who cares? You're coming along too. Got it? Good. Then it's settled. Now we just have to make sure... Really? Three times? That Thomas doesn't hear about it? He I sure did. As did I! We were committing the act of eavesdropping! Committing sounds a bit rough, like a crime. We were merely overhearing your... conversation, if you can even call it that. <sighs> yes, I'm taking my vacation early. Oh, uh, then can we? No, you cannot take your vacation early. Oh, but why not? Because I need people here to manage the school while I'm away, remember? Oh, come on, Dean, old buddy, old pal. We go way back. Not really. Uh, let me finish. Wouldn't it be great if us co-workers got to know each other better through a fun and relaxing island beach trip? We already do. Well, dare I say, not well enough. You know, if this trip goes over well, I wouldn't even hesitate to call you my friend. No, buddy, pal, amigo. Uh, whatever fits your taste, compadre. Me too! No, Thomas, I can't just rearrange everything so you can come with me. It's just not possible. Jay will give you a foot whoop. These hands are meant for cleaning. I will not partake in such an action. No. Party pooper. Sorry, Thomas. It's just the way it goes. Why does that thing get to go? Blob? He has to go with me. I can't leave him here. B -b 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 For the final time, no. Now, if there is anything else, please leave my office. Hmph. <laughs> yeah, sure. Out into the cold we go, Jay. <laughs> Yeesh. Persistent, aren't they? What the heck, Jay? I didn't hear enough pleading from you. I am sorry, Thomas. My appeasement unit has been on Fritz lately. Yeah, well, it's probably trash anyway. Ouch! Harsh words coming from an assistant janitor! <sighs> yeah, whatever. It would have worked anyway. I see what's going on here. And what is that? Slade is copying our thing, and he wants to cut us out of it. I'm afraid I do not know what you mean! Think about it. I have a job teaching, and he gets a job as a dean. I get myself a quirky sidekick, he gets an even quirkier one. Like, what's up with that? I've been reduced to the status of a sidekick to an already low-tier main character. Quiet, Jay. There's no time to get meta. We have to find a way to get to the island before Slade does. How will that solve anything? Uh, well, it will let us, uh, be there first? Look, I don't know. It's a side plot, Jay. Not much fun needs to go into it. Just needs to happen. I thought you said... <laughs>